For those of you that thought you were going to be watching Fishing with Bert Kreischer, I hate to disappoint you, but... What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy, and Nathan and I are on day two of a little spring trip to Ohio. Uh, the weather is gorgeous here. Uh, the musky fishing didn't treat us all that well yesterday, but we we're hoping to turn that around today. We are on a different body of water, a little bit south of where we were yesterday, so we've got warmer water temps. I have a feeling the fish are maybe spawning, but I, they could be post-spawn quite honestly, because we are sitting on 60 plus degree water temps. So maybe some bucktails, maybe some top waters, a lot of glides. Uh, that is the plan for right now. Um, but I should get back to running the boat because we're about to run into something. So hopefully we will catch something and we'll bring it to you shortly. There's a big fish. Big fish just came up neat. Holy cow. Holy cow. She came up and put her nose on it. Oh, yeah, it was a mid 40, I think. Oh my goodness. That was a big fish. Whew. Wowzer, dude. Uh, we need that to happen and have her eat it. Holy cow. I mean, was she looking like she was going to eat? Oh, she, yeah, she came up and like swir and rolled on it. That was a nice, that was a dandy. <laughs> All right. We finally made contact with the fish, and it was a freaking dandy on a quickie here in the marina. I think we know where we're sticking around for a little while. All right, we're gonna do a little pitching around on the docks. I have a shum shum quickie. It's a nice little glide bait by Chaos Tackle. On the ever-present Tranks and nine foot 2020 Surgical Strike. Nathan's throwing an Esox Assault double eight. And uh, yeah, we're looking for the warmest water in the system. We seem to have it here. We're gonna pitch around the docks and work around this bay that we're in. That's the plan. I would assume so, but I guess I don't know. I guess I don't know why it surprises me that the Amish come out here and do this, because I see the Amish trout fishing a lot over in the western Wisconsin. Yeah. Right, but that doesn't require any motorized vehiculars. Bring her up and around. <laughs> oh man, she just came up and swatted it. Holy poop. Is that ever cool? Okay, I'll let you do that. I'm gonna. My goodness, what do we do? It's been so long since we caught one of the dumb things. Okay, I got her. Oh boy, she was... Yeah, hungry. Ooh, the hook's right by your finger there, okay. so be careful. Okay. Alright. Alright. Can let her hang out for a sec. Okay. <laughs> 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 
nice little fatty. <laughs> it surprised the crap out of me. I about jumped out of the boat. <laughs> I don't even know if it's going to stretch our minimum 35 inch here, but we'll get an idea of what she is. Measure. Okay, so she's right to the right to the crack there. All right. Man, finally. Hopefully this is the start of a couple fish afternoon here. <laughs> oh, we got these knuckleheads making fun of us over here. <laughs> All right, let's get another one. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, a fish. Oh, you missed it. You missed it. You, you bumped that, it. That looked like a big fish. That looked like a nice fish. Yep. Oh, you pushed it up out of the water. I was about to curse my luck because I thought I was stuffed, dude. I thought I was about to hit a branch. That looked like a big fish. Did it really? Yeah. That looked like a good fish. It, it had a big tail on it. Yeah. Okay. Shoot. You're supposed to be in your home. <laughs> That fish go after yours? Oh, yeah. oh, come on. Are you kidding me? It's behind it. Dude, that had to have been the same fish. It's literally in the same place. How could it miss this? I was working it so slow. It was freaking microscopic movement. Yeah. That fish just rolled on Nate's bait out there again. Same tree. We gave it about 10 minutes of rest. Come on, fish. our way across. Oh! Oh, oh man. Wow, that sucks. We were just going to blast over and fish the other side. I had it for a split second. I don't really think it felt the hooks that much. But, uh, wow, that stinks. Fish, fish, fish. fish. It came off. Oh. Oh. Dude, that was a nice fish. Yeah. yeah. Dude, the head shakes. Yeah, it was, it was still warm. <sighs> that was two quick fish, right? Yeah, might have been the same fish. Yeah. I gotta go back to the <sighs>
I'd really like to fish some more of that shoreline, but I don't think it's worth dipping in for a couple of casts and right. you know what I mean? <gasps> big fish, big fish just came up. Big fish just came up. Dude, that was that was like another one of those mid mid forties. Where did I cast to? I don't even remember where I cast to. <laughs> Holy cats, man. <sighs> Shoot. That was another dandy, dandy fish, man. I forgot where. Fish? Yeah. Okay. Fast. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> Don't scare me like that. <laughs> oh, goodness. I get loosened up. I set the hook and it went, it went way back. I thought I had a big one on. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, you want me to pop it out? All right. I, I can pop it out, too. I just need okay. the fingers. All right, Nate's just getting warmed up with a largey. <laughs> All right, musky time now. We should just probably call her. What do you think? Is that, are they calling it? I don't know. Well, that sucks. Well, folks, I could not remember the last time I was that close to having a banger day and just, uh, we just couldn't put it together. We got that one nice little 32, about 32 and a half inch fish, spectacular boat side strike, a very cool strike. And then we had these mid 40 inch giants, give or take a couple inches that were just, they came they're just gliding in on the glide baits and uh, so close to hitting. I did have that one pinned up and the head shakes from that fish reminded me of large upper 40 to 50 inch fish that I've fought before. So uh, such a bummer to not be able to put that one in the net. We went from not knowing if we'd see a fish to putting one in the boat and seeing quite a few big fish. So uh, it was cool to be able to put a pattern together obviously it's it's still raining now uh we were chased off by the rain um so that's this this system that came in was definitely what had those fish going we are going to give it another shot tomorrow um we don't have a ton of time because nate and i have to make the eight hour drive back to southern wisconsin so uh fingers crossed you'll see another fishing video from ohio here but uh, if not we've got a bunch of other stuff planned iowa is on the docket uh Canada's not looking so hot, so northern Wisconsin, who knows? We'll figure something out. It's called angling anarchy for a reason. I don't know what's going to happen. It's craziness. We'll figure something out for you folks. I appreciate every single one of you watching. I really do. I can't tell you how much I do. So thank you, everyone, and I will see you on the next video.